Hey, Nick Artigo here. I'm going to show you how to do this drill for thoracic mobilization. Basically getting your upper part of your spine into a position where it can rotate more effectively so that when you're called upon to do any kind of rotational movement, you keep the stress off of the lower back. The upper back, the thoracic part, the part that's the part of the spine that's lined up with the rib cage is the part that's meant for the most rotation. Also, being able to rotate and extend the thoracic spine, being tall, good posture, takes stress off of the shoulder and any type of overhead movement that you may be doing. So this drill, you lie down on your side, place something under your head so that you keep the neck in neutral be a pillow. I have a yoga block right here. This is kind of a soft yoga block. I have my knees bent and I have the knees stacked, the hips stacked. I keep the hips stacked. Place my palms together in front of my navel and then I take my arm up and at an angle and try to bring the shoulder blade of my top shoulder toward the ground. If I'm moving with the breath, I will inhale when I reach the arm up and back. Exhale, back down. Inhale and exhale. Keeping this shoulder, I mean this hip, stacked on top of the other, the shoulder moves top part of the spine rotates. Now you may not be able to get all the way back as far as I do, it may be more like this. Either way, you're kind of taking this angle. Other side, it's like this. Side lying. Notice that this hip stays stacked on top of the other hip. This knee remains stacked. I don't want to start moving the rest of the body in order to get my arm down to the floor. I want to keep this knee stacked, this hip stacked, and also place something between the knees. And place something between the knees like my hand or a yoga block. Keep a little better neutral alignment, a little bit closer to neutral alignment in the hips when I stack something between the knees. So, if you found benefit from this video, do me a favor and leave a comment below. And if you want to get more content, more stuff that's not available on the blog, not available on the regular YouTube channel, then click the link that is attached and connected to this video. You'll have a chance to do that. Thank you.